Once upon a time, there was a rich man who spent his whole life thinking about how he could get richer. One morning, the rich man, who owned a farm, walked from his house to his fields. He looked at his crops and he rubbed his hands together greedily. Mine! All mine! He looked out across the farm at his servants, who were loading grain, sack after sack, in the hot sun. I'm very rich, but I'd like to be even richer. The next week, he walked from his house to his fields. He looked at his crops and rubbed his hands together greedily. Mine, oh mine! He noticed that some birds were pecking at his fields of grain. Go away! It's mine, all mine! You can't have any of it! Another week went by. The rich man walked from his house to his fields. He looked at his crops and rubbed his hands together greedily. Mine, all mine! He noticed a poor man stopping to pick up some grain, which had accidentally spilled on the floor. The poor man had a wife and three children to feed and nothing to eat. This is mine! It's all mine! You can't have any of it! The rich man walked home. He thought long and hard about his grain. It's spilling out! The birds are eating it! Poor people are coming to steal the grain! They're spilling out of the door! I can't allow that to happen! The grain is mine! All mine! What shall I do? The next morning, the rich man walked from his house to his fields and called to his servants. and build a bigger one. Oh, and when you've finished, you can start to build a second one. I've got tons and tons of grain and I'm going to store it all. Then I will sell it and I'll be even richer, richer beyond my wildest dreams. Day after day, the rich man went to his fields to watch the servants building his enormous barns. He made sure that no one came by to take so much as a handful of his precious grain. At last, the barns were finished. The rich man walked home. He thought long and hard about his life. I have so much that I will never need to work again. In the morning, I will go out and buy myself some fine clothes. I'll order the best food and crates of the best wine. I'm going to have a wonderful time spending all my money. And it's mine. All mine. But that very night, the man died in his sleep. No one mourned, no one wept for the man who had all the riches in the world, but who kept them all for himself. Don't be like that rich man. People like that can never please God. Being rich won't make you happy. Being selfish is always a bad choice in the end. And that is the end of our story.